I'm cleaning up my homeschool room right now, our dining room slash homeschool room, um, just to, I wanna get it all prepared. We just finished school last week and I am ready to have all of my curriculum that's in my living room. I'm getting that out of the way and just getting the school room prepped. This is normally something that I do like at the end of the summer, closer towards the beginning of the school year, just do it all. But I am quite pregnant right now. I am due in like four weeks, four and a half weeks. And um, so that's not something that I wanna push off till later on. I'm motivated to get it done now. I have a bunch of curriculum in my living room that's been sitting there since like the, the spring and I just wanna get it out and get this checked off my list. Today I'm just gonna be cleaning out and getting everything ready to go to prepare for next school year. Past couple weeks has gotten really cluttered and I normally like to keep it a little bit more, I don't know, like not so much stuff going on here. Uh, this was Larissa's project for her homeschool book club. Uh, the girls made me these adorable little frames for uh, from Michael's for Mother's Day, but the backs came out, so I don't know. Um, and then we just have a bunch of extra carousel things. When we had our old homeschool room, like a real homeschool room, each girl had a desk and one of these. And so I just had to, I'm gonna kind of condense. We have our homeschool cart here, just needs some love and attention. And then here's all our curriculum from this year, I'm trying to get this cleared out. Um, and then lastly, this is a really basic homeschool room, you guys. This is my daughter's schoolwork from school. Um, all her extra like books and things like that. I told her just leave it here for now and I will go through it. It's my husband's work. <laughs> and then here we have like, just things have just kind of piled up. Um, this is my daughter's, what's it called? My fifth grader, this is her books. Um, she's pretty much finished with everything. Actually, I don't even know where all her books went. So I guess I'm gonna have to find that because <laughs> I knew she had more than that. And then this is where I just keep all their little memories, all their like, things that they've made that I just want to, um, that I just want to store. I just keep it in there. And at the end of the year, like tests and things like that, that they do well on and things that like my little one, she draws and colors and things like that for me. So, um, I just want to keep those like, I don't know how long I'll keep them, but I'll keep them for now. So here we have our morning cart. Um, and then here's our little anniversary card the girls made us this year so cute <laughs> um, anyway I like the idea of this however it doesn't like fit all of our books exactly how I'd like it to like they can't stand up some of them have to like lay down like that and it's just hard to get to everything um, and I feel like these morning carts are best like to roll out when you're rolling them and this just stays here so what I'm thinking of is actually cleaning well I'm definitely cleaning this out and replacing it I have a bookshelf like a narrow bookshelf in my um old school room that I could put there and this would fit everything on it and more because I have so much you guys I'm just gonna I'm just thinking out loud bear with me I said in another video I look like a crazy curriculum lady look I'm not even joking this is all of our curriculum it's been sitting there for months it's driving me crazy this is stuff that I have to like get rid of and sell and donate. We're just not going to use. So I cannot wait to get all of this out of here. Um, but I'm trying to fit it in here and in here and in here. So I'm thinking of maybe adding another bookcase. We'll see. Even though it looks like kind of a, like a sort of a mess right now, it actually has pretty much stayed pretty clutter free and easy to clean up, which I like. It's just gotten like this maybe the last two weeks or so. Uh, if you're looking for like a real, not real, but you know what I mean, more formal homeschool room, I have videos of that for our old homeschool room and the reason why I change. I'll link all of those videos down below from my playlist if you wanna see that. I'm used to filming, but I'm not used to like filming when I'm pregnant. And so it was just weird to like turn on the camera and just see my belly sticking out. Started the words that I completed But that was then so long ago 
I told you then, like I say now, that we were golden. Now you're not here, you brought us down, I told you so. Oh, how I wish I didn't care that we were okay. That I could just erase, rewind, let it roll. Meet me back here next year. And I'll be fine by then. We were on a high, but now we're letting go. And finding the way back is all I know. All I know from now. I'm thinking by myself. I'm minding just my own. So when we meet again, I'm fine by then. Fine by then. I'll be fine by then. I go to bed to get up early. I go to work and not much change I met a girl and she's quite funny But I'm not quite there, ready for love It's been alright without you here though it was better When you were there right by my side that long ago Oh how I wish I didn't care if I was okay that I could just erase, rewind, let it roll But now I've been there and done that And now I'm fine by then We were on a high but now we're letting go And finding the way back is all I know All I know from now I'm thinking about myself, I'm minding just my own So when we meet again I'm fine by then, fine by then, I'll be fine by then We were on a high but now we're letting go And finding the way back is all I know, all I know From now I'm thinking by myself, I'm minding just my own So when we meet again, I'm fine by then, fine by then Alright, believe it or not, this actually is organized now <laughs> So we have stuff that we're still working on slash we'll go for next year. This is all of our, like mostly Larissa, my oldest one. This is all her curriculum. I'm just going to put it in a, um, I always put it in a binder or not a binder, a bin. Um, and then this is, I don't know what to do with these. I love these, these little projects. I just, not these frames. I'm keeping those, but the projects. She just sharpened her pencil. These little like marine biology projects. I don't know. I just, I don't have room for them. I think I might just take a picture. These are just books that have to go on our, back on our bookcase, coloring books, um, teacher things that I want to keep. And then there's just all this curriculum to sell. I'm going to put it in my pile over there of stuff to sell and then have to go through these, see what glue is out. The tape and that type of thing but anyway at least it's all organized and now i know where it's all going so it'll be easier to um put where it goes So everything is completely cleared out. That's cleared out. This I just put here for now. This is all uh, their coloring books because they still use these. And like their art supplies and stuff. Um, crayons and that type of thing. Everything's cleared out of here. The only thing I have is um, these books here. They're going to go on our bookshelf. But like I said, I'm waiting on this because I don't know... I think we'll be able to get all the curriculum in these uh, between here and here, and I don't know about the cart yet. So when I put all of the all of it back, then I'll figure it out then. But it feels so good to have this all done and cleared out and ready to go. It's just been weighing on me, so I'm so happy that it's all cleared out and then ready for all next year's curriculum to go in. Hopefully this was a little bit motivating for you to get things cleared out. Uh, but if not, if you're still in summer mode and like I'm not even 
thinking about that right now till later, that's fine too. Like I said, mostly, most of the time that's me. Um, I just wanted to get this done now and over with so that it was one thing that I could check off my mental list. Like it's been on my mind for so long. So I'm, that's the only reason why most of the time I wait too. So if you did like this video, you can give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys soon. Bye-bye.